Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to OMSI 2. Today is the day, folks. The Renown has been released for OMSI 2. There is a link in the description to go and get that for yourself from Studio Polygon. But here it is, and to commemorate such a monumental occasion, we're driving this particular Go North East spec. Now, for those of you that might be new to my channel, you might not understand why this is so important. But back many, many years ago, I drove the AD156 Renown and I repainted it in this livery. And when I say repainted it, I didn't do as good a job as this. This looks absolutely sensational, but I had a little crack at it. I uh, messed about for about 10 minutes in paint.net or even Microsoft Paint and uh, made a video on the lime. There's a link in the description if you want to go check that out. I warn you, it's terrible. It's from like six, seven years ago. I can't remember. But for this monumental occasion of the release of the Renown, we're driving this lime livery. Now, this is a full Go North East spec. You'll notice things such as uh, the lights uh, are, of course, like that. But we've got a full rear destination and the number plate is at the bottom. We've also got little quirky things like the cycle-friendly bus. And yes, this window is meant to be blacked out like that because that if you look is where your bike goes well, there we go you see unless i mean surely you don't go with there no okay you've been silly now but yeah cycle friendly bus now uh, of course it's got this lovely ooh, it's got this blue inside that's a bit funny isn't it lovely but of course it's got the go northeast maquette i really really do like that maquette they stuck with that for a long time didn't they um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's it, do you know what? It's a really, really lovely spec. This is new as of, what day are we on today? We're on Wednesday today. So I was sent this uh, new spec today. You've got things like, warning, have you checked the radiator? It's the driver's responsibility to see that the radiator water levels are correct at all times. We've got things like this uh, heating thing here, which actually, if you look, it has been fixed. It's no longer clipping through there on this spec. Uh, today we are going to be driving the 83A through to Westfield Police HQ uh, and uh, yeah I'm, I'm really excited this has got an electric ramp so before we get going let's fire the bus up and let's actually see this electric ramp in action okay um any guesses? Do we have to kneel, maybe? Maybe we do. Right, let's just hide that. We'll, we'll kneel. Now go out. Nope. Um, now. That's in. No, okay. There's probably something really straightforward in the manual that actually explains how to do that. But, of course, I've not read the manual. Let's get that shut. There we go. Get that door shut. Oh, it's looking quiet in here. Quite a loud spec, isn't it? It seems really loud in comparison. Right, okay, I'm going to get myself set up and uh, I shall be back in a minute. Okay, so when I say I'm getting myself set up, what I'm actually doing is loading the uh, the actual manual, which I'm just going to have to, if you just bear with me, the sound's going to disappear. There we go, sound is back again, excellent. Yeah, because uh, I've realised I don't know what the ticket to pin is, as per usual. It's always the same, isn't it? It's the same story, different day. It's that many different pins, isn't it? Uh, in fact, I didn't actually need to do that at all, because it's the same pin as what it always has been, 9810. There we go. Get that in there. We'll uh, accept that. Yeah, lovely. That is the departure time. We are a little bit early. Now, I'm going to have to put these on because I don't actually know where I'm going, as per usual. Uh, right, hang on. Have we got stand F over here? No. Okay, stand E... So that must be stand F. No, that's stand B. Right, where's stand F? A, B. Where is it? Stand D, E, C. Right, I, I don't wish to panic, everybody. Is this it here? Oh, you stand F. Is, is that what that is? I, I can't... That's stand A. Right, okay. Oh, it's there! Right, oh, okay, it's right in the middle of nowhere, okay. So we'll uh, we'll just move that on by a few minutes. There we go. Are we ready to go? I'm excited. Do you know what? I reckon that nobody's going to watch this video because you'll all be out enjoying the renown yourself. We're on an early morning spec, of course, now that we've got the lighting on. It's become a much more harsh light. I wonder what... 
reg, uh, what reg we've got, what uh, indicator we've got. We've got uh, just the usual clicker. We've got no buzzer. Maybe the go northeast spec didn't have a buzzer. Right, here we go. So, let's just uh, 83A driver switch off engines. Oh, it don't matter, does it? We'll be going in a minute. So, let's go on our Hanover. Eight. Yep. Yeah. Oh, hang on. No, that's that's eight to Ingle, but I don't want that one. Oh, you've messed it up now, Joe. Flipping heck. 83. And then if you cycle through the numbers, A is there. To Wavesworth, to Westfield Police Station. There we go, Westfield. It does seem really, really loud on the outside, this particular spec, doesn't it? Like, really, really loud. Right, hang on. Do, do, do. Right, let's get everybody on. Hello! Welcome to the Studio Polygon Renown. Okay, not up for talking, are you, child? Okay. Yeah, this is really loud. Maybe it's... Is it too loud? Is it meant to be this loud? It sounds like it's got a blown exhaust, doesn't it? The exhaust's got a hole in Perhaps this will be a little bit quieter. I'm going to have to shut that flipping heck. It is too loud, isn't it? It's blowing my eardrums off this. Right, let's go. Away we go. Because uh, I know we're not 0.5 early, but Yorkshire, we always end up running late on anyway, don't we? So uh, it'll be fine. Right, so we're off to Westfield. I do like the 83A. It was a really enjoyable route when I did it. I just didn't like the nonsense about the fact there'd been a fatality and this, that and the other at the junction and there'd been a road traffic collision where multiple deaths and all that. It, it was just completely unnecessary, so I haven't driven it. But of course, because this bus doesn't have announcements, which there might actually be a, a spec where you can get announcements, I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I guess it depends if any had them in real life. I don't know if they did. Let me know in the comments if you know something I don't there. But uh, yeah, there's no announcements on this. There's a lot of flipping traffic, I can tell you that much. Have we got a different horn on this? Oh no, it's the same horn. Yeah, I, I genuinely don't think it's meant to be that loud on the outside, but I can't quite work out why it would be like that. So maybe it is meant to be like that. Right, off we go. Get our foot down and hope for the best. Yeah, please do make sure. I mean, if you're a Joe Plus member and you're watching this the day before, um, then obviously it's not out because, of course, this will come out on the Saturday for Joe Plus members to watch. Um, but, yeah, if you're watching this on the Sunday, the Renown is out. I believe it comes out at 10 a.m., I think. Oh, get that close, cat in itself. Thing. Yeah, I think it comes out at 10am. I believe that's what Josh said to me. Oh, the seats have fallen down. Um, I believe he said 10am, but obviously that might be subject to change if there's any last minute bugs. So please do keep an eye on the Studio Polygon website. There's a link in the description where you can do that. And yeah, I'm really, really hoping that you're going to enjoy this as much as I have done. I mean, this week on the run-up to the release has just been Studio Polygon, Studio Polygon, Studio Polygon, hasn't it? Literally, we've bypassed everything else. Now, don't panic because a couple of people were asking about the other series, such as City Skylines, things like that. Please do not panic. City Skylines is still in production. It's just because of the exciting uh, news regarding Studio Polygon's release that we've, uh, that we've really kind of hammered it this week, trying to get all the different specs in that we could prior to the release. So yeah, normal service from next week will resume. Uh, City Skylines will make a return tomorrow. And, uh, of course... We will, uh, we will continue as we were. Now, yeah, I, 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 it's just, you've only got one opportunity, haven't you, to be, to, you know, to build the hype, to be excited about this, because once it's released, everyone's got it, haven't they? Um, of course, it will only be available by uh, the Studio Polygon website for now. It might come to Steam one day, but it won't be for the time being. I did explain that yesterday. Uh, in the mainline spec video, but just in case you haven't watched that, basically anything published through Steam, Studio Polygon lose 70% of their income because 30% or 40% has to be paid to Aerosoft 
and of course then steam for hosting it so yeah 30 and 40 percent so that's 70 percent of the 13 pound 50 that you pay for your street light that has just gone out the window so 13 pound 50 you pay studio polygon only get just over four pound four pound and five pence to be precise so that is why they've decided to cut the ties with aerosoft and steam and host it through their website so that they don't have to pay that because as far as i'm concerned they've put in all the hard work they should reap the benefits i know that's a bit of a controversial opinion but it's my opinion and that's what you come here for on uh, on a weekly basis or whenever you do oh hang on there we go bit of indication wouldn't have gone to miss mr taxi Unless you were indicating and I was too busy ranting, of which case my apologies, sir. Of course, this is going to come with a shed load of liveries, I believe. Oh, actually, hang on. I don't know if it is going to come with deliveries or if it's just going to come with the demonstrator livery. And, uh, and these liveries will be available as a free separate download. Because I know that, obviously, if they're selling company liveries, it's a bit dodgy ground, isn't it? So, yeah, it might just come with the demonstrator livery. Yeah, that is really loud. I, d I don't think it's meant to be this loud. I'm going to keep saying that every time I open my flipping doors, aren't I? But yeah, I don't think this is meant to be this loud. It does, the engine sounds a lot more knackered on this spec, though. Maybe it is actually meant to be like it's got a hole in the exhaust. Because they are really loud if you've, if you've got no exhaust silencer on. They are really loud, like ridiculously loud. If I open the window. Oh, yeah. Oh, we've committed. Sorry. That would badder me, wouldn't it? Oh, well. Doesn't matter, does it? Oh, prepare to have your ears deafened. Thank you, child. Thank you, other child. Lovely. That's dedication, isn't it? They must go a long way for school if they're up at 6.27 in the morning. Flipping Nora. Oh, we've got the nice heritage spec coming the other way now. I'm hoping that I can get to about there. Yep, that'll do. Because I want a... Uh, look at that. I want a... Uh, it's a bit dark, isn't it? It would have been better if I got it from the other end. Oh, well, I might be able to get a nice photo later on. Yeah, it definitely sounds a lot more knackered, doesn't it? Oh, hang on. Child getting on. go right nobody else that'll do oh look at that over the river a couple of viaducts isn't there this is hillswick viaduct next one's norburn road quite a sluggish spec isn't it compared to the rest of them but I guess these buses are now getting on a bit with uh, with Go North East I don't even know if they've still got them I wouldn't have thought so because they had a massive influx of new vehicles didn't they and of course Newcastle have got a uh, clean air zone so yeah they really won't have these now will they that is such a shame lovely lovely vehicles these mud on the road no there's not it's been raining have a bit of a there we go we'll just cut straight across that'll do look at that oh colleague coming the other way there we go we'll give him a wave I say colleague he's not a colleague is he he's a uh He's a Yorkshire Terrier driver, where obviously go north east the line. We're a bit out of place, aren't we? Maybe Yorkshire Terrier have treated themselves to a vehicle. You know, they bought an old vehicle. Maybe one of the new ones has broken down, so they've had to draft in a fleet of old renowns. That'd be good, wouldn't it? 
And weirdly enough, the timetable's actually quite easy to, to stick to on this, which makes a nice change. The N14. That's not a route we can drive, is it, by the looks of things? There we go, that'll do. Foot down. We're a little bit late now. As I said, the timetable's easier to stick to, and then we end up running late. Flipping heck. That is not what you need. Yeah, if I had to say, you know, if I had to compare the two, the AD156 spec and this spec, I would say that the Studio Polygon Renown just beats it to the post, you know, it's just a little bit marginally better. Than, oh, hang on, stop the quest, we better stop. Yeah, it's, it's marginally better than, uh, than the AD156, and when I say marginally better, I mean leaps and bounds ahead. But of course, let's not forget that that AD156 Renown that we had was a Midtown Madness 2 conversion. So that's probably like 20 years old, that particular model. And for the time being, for the time being, for the time that it was released, it was good. It was one of the first UK single decks that we had for Omsi, wasn't it? Apart from all those kind of Dennis Darts that were never really released, that people had on the PC that they weren't meant to. Oh, it brings me back to the Mallow Port days on Omsi, I tell you. But I uh, never actually had that map. I wasn't privy to inside uh, information regarding that one. They must all be undercover coppers, all off to the police station. But um, but yeah, so you know it was good for the day, but this really does knock spots off it. I mean, you know, I've been nothing but complimentary about this. It's been the odd little bug we've encountered while we've been uh, while we've been testing it. Of which Josh always says, yeah, you never actually tell me, do you, what the bugs are. You just point them out to the, the nation via your stream, via your videos. I'm like, yeah, sorry about that. Hey, dear me. I like this bit. It's a long time since we drove up here. I think I've only driven up here once, haven't I? Hello. Right, there we go. I might actually turn my voice up on this louder because I don't think you'll be able to hear what I'm saying over this engine. Good morning, Good morning mate. How are you? Flipping out, we're going to be full and standing from here. Uh, right, weekly ticket. Yeah, 50p. Tar love. Give him a double flash on the hazard lights. It does sound rough, this bus, doesn't it? Absolutely rough. Rough as out. Could strike a match on it, I tell you. It's so now are we back here. Smooth as silk back here. Oh, hang on. Look. We can't really sit because there's, there's people in the way. That is one thing I've noticed we could do with some more, like, CCTV-style cameras. Oh, I wonder, I wonder if I skip there and we'll, we'll look left like that. Let's go, there's some outside cameras. Where, where are the outside cameras? Oh no, this one doesn't have the outside cameras. Right, okay. It's still a bit dark, isn't it? Well, what we'll do is we'll, we'll have with the sun. Just coming up like that. Oh, look at that. Bit of, bit of shrubbery in the, in the foreground there. Lovely. You can never have a too good a photo, can you, for the cover? Right, here we go, turning right. Oh, we're just, we're just following it round, that's fine. Yeah, this is a really nice route, I'm enjoying myself here. Of course, the 83A is the only one that comes up, so it's kind of like a, a bit of route that just randomly sticks out into the abyss, because I don't think there's any other routes that come round here. At all, is there?
Oh, hang on. Redwood Station. I mean, there's the railway line there. Way straight over. Ah, they must all be going for a train. That's why everybody's here. No, no, not as many getting off as you'd think. A few, but... There's someone that he's not going to give way, is he? There we go. National speed limits. We'll put our foot down. I mean, I know that doesn't really mean a lot, does it, on uh, when you're driving this bus? I wonder if we've got a... Ah, we could sit here, but the problem is, is we can't see what we're doing, can we? Ah, there we go. Lovely. Look at that. It's good, isn't it? Oh, it is fantastic. Yeah, I want to see you all in the Discord. There's a link in the description to the Discord, of course. I want to see you all in there, and I want to see every single photograph and screenshot that you take of your B10. I want to see it. I want to see the routes that you're driving them on, the liveries that you're driving them in. There'll be some awesome reprint packs on Fellows Film Studios, I imagine, because there just always is. So yeah, I want to see them all. Make sure you join the Discord and post it in the Bus Simulator screenshots uh, chat. I think I think there's going to be a lot of Studio Polygon renowns in there, you know. Oh, hang on. Bouncing along, aren't we? Pleasure to be alive. How are you? Oh, he's walked off. All right, okay. Westfield Close. This is a bit of an odd bus stop. It's out in the middle of nowhere, isn't it? Maybe that pavement on the left there goes to uh, somebody's house. Maybe there's a big housing estate behind these uh, trees. I always wonder with this 83A if he actually meant to take it further and then like due to time constraints just kind of thought oh we'll just terminate it here, it'll be fine. I wonder if that's why I thought oh we'll, we'll make an accident and make it look like you know get the police out. I wonder, I wonder. I mean I guess we'll never know and, and to be honest with you he'll probably say oh no it was always meant to be like that. But yeah, I, I often wonder if this was meant to go further, but it just never did. Because it just seems a bit of an odd way of doing things, doesn't it? You'd, you'd think that he'd just terminate it at, like, just, you know, go around a little housing estate and, and have done with the matter. There we go. So here we are at, uh, there we go, a light passengers and U-turn at the roundabout. Well, we won't bother with the U-turn at the roundabout, because... Uh, it doesn't really matter, does it? We'll probably just go in there and reverse back out. We'll turn that engine off. Because I can hardly hear myself think. There we go. And, uh, yeah, here we are at Westfield Police Headquarters. Please do let me know in the comments what you think of that. I was uh, a little bit touched, actually, when Josh included this particular repaint. Because, of course, it meant that we could relive uh, our, uh, our MM2 days with my terrible repaints. But there we go. Yes, if you did enjoy today's video, please do click that like button. It's always appreciated. What route are you driving first with what spec of renown? Let me know in the comments. And, of course, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe because, of course,
after this, the next big thing, possibly, from Studio Polygon is the Gemini. It's, uh, it's not on the horizon anytime soon, but when it is, I'd like to think uh, we did a fairly good job with this, didn't we, to, uh, as a hype builder. So I'd like to think here is where you'll be hearing it first, folks. So make sure you subscribe if you haven't already, so you don't miss out on any of that. Other than that, as I say, thank you so much for watching, and hopefully, I'll see you all next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.